Why is there no laundry in Germany on Sundays? Today we will be speaking about a strange oddity over in Germany. Laundry. Naturally the Germans do their laundry pretty much like any other country, but with one noticeable exception. Keine Wäsche am Sonntag. Hi everyone, welcome to today's installment of Knowledgeka. I am Danny Ward. Germany, one of the political powerhouses of Europe. But not on a Sunday, mind you. That is the designated day of rest, and the Germans would like to keep it that way. Thank you very much. For anyone that has visited Deutschland or knows a bit about the country, may be familiar with the fact that most, if not all, local shops nearby will close on a Sunday. But the real shock for most people, I'm sure, will be the lack of laundry done on a Sunday. There are a few reasons for this. Primarily though, it can be boiled down to social pressures or legal restrictions. In some German states, there are laws dictating when you can and cannot make loud noise. Most countries do adopt a similar set of restrictions. For example, here in the UK, if you fancy getting riddled with noise complaints and a bunch of angry neighbours giving you evil eyes as you start the car each morning, setting your Nordic death metal tunes to full blast at 3.30am may be a really good way to go about it. Germany, like a lot of mainland Europe, has a large population of its citizens living in medium-rise rented apartment blocks, and so noise considerations are incredibly important. As such, German laws exist that establish and protect the Ruhrzeit, or quiet time, which runs 10pm to 6am, Monday to Saturday, and then all day Sunday. This means no loud washing machines or dryers during those times. If you're in a sparsely populated area and have no adjoining neighbours, these rules almost certainly won't be strictly enforced. Some apartment buildings have washing facilities in the basement, so again, this is a way of getting around these rules. If you did so happen to fall ill of the rules, however, and get a burning desire to start washing bricks at 2am, you could very well expect a visit from the Ordnungsamt, or local police, accompanied with a fine. These noise police don't mess around. Casting our minds back to the fact that shops close on Sunday in Germany, similarly, the very act of doing work can be looked down upon, including laundry. Because of this, there is often an unwritten rule in place not to hang out washing on a Sunday. I am sure there will be many exceptions to this rule, particularly in younger neighbourhoods where cultural shifts rapidly change, but it still goes to show just how seriously the day of rest is taken over there. Not only this, but there is large pressure from unions and churches to keep it this way for the good of the people, society and all things in Ordnum. Break this unwritten social convention and you could be faced with a dreaded Blockwart. This word stems back from Nazi Germany with block wardens, but in modern Germany it often refers to a busybody or a snoop who enjoys nothing more than to complain about people breaking the rules. So don't break the rules and everything will be wunderbar, alles klar? So having said all this, how comes every German I have actually spoke to washes their laundry on a Sunday? No problem. Again, it's very much an age thing. Naturally, a lot of the people I speak to are younger and simply don't care about these things. Times change and all that. Furthermore, there was also a law passed in the year 2000 that legally stated that using a washing machine on a Sunday was perfectly acceptable, so long as it was considered to fall within acceptable limits. So no washing those bricks, I know you're thinking about it. Ich hoffe dir hat die heutige Folge gefallen? Das war Knowledge. Bleib hungrig nach Faktetisiert. <laughs>